Hey guys, it's Max. I realized that in that last video, the frames were dropped. So here's that match again. Okay, so our guys are in the corner, and I'm just going to step through piece by piece, and hopefully we won't drop so many frames that you can't see what's going on. So you can see these guys are approaching. They're approaching that pocket, and they're avoiding where they have been before. I'm just stepping through it nice and slow so you can see it and you can always repeat the video. And you can see how they're getting out of there. They're just avoiding where they've been. They're painting the ground. Let me propose the following idea that would be an improvement to this that we won't go over in the lectures. Imagine if the robot just pretended to do that series of motions ahead of time, right? So imagine that instead of actually visiting those locations, which he can see, he just imagines himself walking through them. If you can write code that does that, the robot can go straight for the exit of that pocket without ever getting caught inside and without ever having to do any advanced pathing. So consider that as an option. Now check out this guy. He's one of the guys who's stuck. I think his friends got in his way part way and now he's confused about where he's been and where he's going. So we'll have him get impatient in the next episode. Anyway, this is just a little quickie and I hope that this renders properly.